One of the most popular areas in El Paso County to pop fireworks on Independence Day weekend didn't see as much activity this year due to the pandemic. We're talking about Red Sands. KTSM 9 News reporter Tatiana Favela is live on the Far East Side with more on this. Well, there was definitely a lot of activity happening at fireworks stands like these days before the holiday as El Pasoans prepared to celebrate despite the ban. However, Red Sands, for example, was a little less popping this year. We had more people the following day on Sunday than we did on actual on 4th of July. And so that was, uh, it was, I was actually shocked by, by the numbers. Red Sands seeing less activity on 4th of July than normal. The Texas Rescue Patrol who monitors the site says multiple agencies played a huge role in making sure rules were being followed. There was a, a large command presence uh, here and I think that had a lot to do with uh, deterring a lot of the, the, uh, the individuals that, that were supposedly going to come out here because I had heard rumors there's going to be a lot of people here and they didn't show up. The chief of the Texas Rescue Patrol, Jamil Mutron, says in previous years there are between 10 to 15,000 people who visit the site. However, most of the leftover trash comes from those visiting to party, not those off-roading. They'll show up just driving regular two-wheel drive vehicles and they'll park along the highway and the street and everything. And the sole purpose for them coming out here is to just congregate with other individuals and group up and drink. And that's the problem. Within El Paso city limits, the El Paso Fire Department says it responded to over 3,000 911 calls on the 4th of July. Not all were related to fireworks. However, the department did respond to 14 fires. One third of the calls happening around 9 p.m. Despite less activity in the county, the message to prevent the spread of COVID-19 continues. If you're looking for a place to replace the bars and nightclubs and all that, and you want to throw a big party out there and invite a lot of people to come down, well, it looks to me that the county doesn't want that to happen. And I think that's why you're seeing these, these uh, orders uh, being implemented by our local authorities, because they're trying to prevent that. This morning, sheriff's office detention, officers, deputies, and jail inmates picked up 85 bags of trash left over from the holiday weekend in the Montana Vista area, including outside of Red Sands. Live in Far East El Paso, Tatiana Favela, KTSM 9 News. All right, Tatiana, thank you very much.